the most memorized book on the planet lays in my hand, the Quran. There's no doubt that there are different methods to memorize the book. And speaking of methods of memorization, spaced repetition is widely known for its long-term success rates. It works with languages, medicine, math, coding, financial terms, most things really. But does it work with the Quran? First of all, for those of you who don't know, spaced repetition is the practice of repeating and reviewing information at different time intervals to embed them in your long-term memory and beat the forgetting curve. So for the next two weeks, I'm going to find out if it works with the Holy Quran by trying to memorize Surah Al-Mulk. Surah Al-Mulk consists of exactly 33 lines. So if I try to memorize three lines a day for the next two weeks, I should be able to memorize it all with a little bit of time to review if needed. Now, to actually memorize it, I played each verse three times off of my phone. The first time was to understand it and hear how it was pronounced. The second was to attempt to pronounce it and the third was to attempt to pronounce it once again. I then moved on and repeated this two more times for a total of three lines. Now after that, I repeated all three lines once again just to make sure I was good to go. Now here's the spaced repetition part. I reviewed the three lines the next day when I came to memorize a fresh new three lines. I then did that once again at the end of the week and again at the end of the two weeks. Now I know this only confirms the full cycle for the first three lines, but there is no doubt that if it works for the first three lines, it's probably going to work for the whole sword. And after almost two weeks, I had finally arrived at the last three lines. Three verses remain, so I've decided I'm going to change the location up a bit and I'm going to go outside and pick a nice calm location where I can memorize the last three verses in. Let's go. <laughs> We're here, can't believe I'm one of those iPhone mic guys, but for now, well, here it is, let's go. قُلْ أَرَأَيْتُمْ إِنْ أَهْلَكَنِيَ اللَّهُ وَمَنْ مَعْيَ أَوْ رَحِمَنَا فَمَنْ يُجِيرُ الْكَافِرِينَ مِنْ عَذَابٍ أَلِيمٍ قل هو الرحمن آمنا به وعليه توكلنا فستعلمون من هو في ضلال مبين قل أرأيتم إن أصبح ماؤكم غورا فمن يأتيكم بماء صدق الله العظيم. Aside from the verses themselves, there is a beautiful thing that I came to realize when I was done with this whole thing. It only took me about 15 minutes a day to memorize those three lines. So if I slowly build the habit from 15 minutes and three lines to 30 minutes and five lines or even 60 minutes and half a page, I could memorize the entire Quran in a few years. And what an honor that would be. So I've decided that inshallah I will be continuing this habit. You see, I believe that nothing's impossible so long as you have Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala by your side. You see, we've got the most powerful entity and the one and only ever living creator as the master of our affairs. So I really think we should all start acting more like it.